I'm in Corinth, Texas, hiking the Elm Fork Trail. This trail is an out and back trail. Should be about four miles long in total. The beginning of this trail has been a little trashy. There's been some graffiti and stuff too, so a little bit of a bummer, but as you get further in, it, it, it's okay. Looks like snow on the ground from all the uh, cottonwood trees shedding. So it looks like the trail should continue that way, but actually I need to take a left and cross this creek. Um, and I missed that and check the map. So if you ever do this trail, just be careful of that. There's no great way to get across this creek either, other than this, maybe this tree. It looks like there was once kind of a bridge. Not really sure, we're gonna have to figure it out. So I crossed on this log, but definitely a little bit sketchy. So let's keep going. Gosh, I missed the main trail again and had to pull up all trails again to figure out which way I was actually supposed to go. There are just so many path through here and uh, nothing is marked so I'm struggling a little bit to find the actual trail. I'm not sure that this is right or even worth it so I'm gonna turn back. Well I think this trail was a bust. I got about a mile in and uh, it was fine but um, I cannot find where the trail is supposed to go. I've tried four or five different different um, paths and uh, all of them just get super dense with brush and super thick and I can't get through them. Um, so I think I'm just gonna have to turn back and uh, call this one quits. That's kind of a bummer. I had uh, had some hopes for this trail and uh, yeah, I, I don't know that I would recommend this one. Uh, definitely done some better trails in the DFW area but um, yeah this one's been a little overgrown definitely difficult to figure out where I'm going I might come back and try it again maybe see if there's a place to park on the opposite end of the trail and see if I can somehow make it to where uh, where I was just now but um, yeah I'd say that this one was a bust there's another trail at this trailhead called the Pilot Knoll Trail, and it's actually quite a bit longer than this one's supposed to be. It's in total, it's an, it's an out and back also, but in total about seven miles. And I've done it before, and it was actually not too bad. Um, so I'll probably make a video on it uh, soon. Um, but yeah, I would not, not recommend this, uh, this trail right here. You know, I guess, uh, that goes to show that, uh, you know, this is just part of the adventure. Trying to find some good trails to hike uh, in an area that's not known for hiking, obviously. Probably, you know, bound to hit some snags and find some trails that are not good. So if you're looking for a mile hike, this one's okay, you know, until you can't find the trail anymore. But all good. On to the next trail. Well, despite not finishing the trail, I hope you enjoyed uh, the video and uh, seeing kind of how it, it really is uh, when I go and try new trails and uh, you know sometimes they're a bust so hope you enjoyed anyway and thanks for watching.